All righty. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Colby Sawyer's virtual information session. Uh, we wish you were, you were here in person, um, but this is our counseling staff. We'll go right into some introductions um, and we'll go from there. All righty. So I'm John Conley, Assistant Director of Admissions here at Colby Sawyer. Um, I work with um, students in business administration, healthcare administration, administration and sport management. I also work with international population um, and anything from you know onboarding to inquiries to financial aid for our international students as well. Hi everyone, um, I'm Izzy Price. Um, I solely work with um, the School of Social Sciences. Um, so students who are interested in everything from child development to psychology um, as well as undecided students. Hi everyone, I'm Lily O'Connor and I work with all students interested in nursing, public health, health science, and exercise science. Hi, my name is Kat Gabert. I am the admission counselor that works for the School of Art and Lab Sciences. So I work specifically with students in art, bio, creative and professional writing, environmental science and studies, graphic design, and medical lab science. All righty. Some fast facts about Colby Sawyer College. Um, we're just under a thousand students overall, located in New London, New Hampshire. We got about a 200 acre campus, uh, which we call nature's background. We're surrounded by um, a lot of great lakes and mountains. Mount Kearsarge would be one of them right nearby. Um, on in New London, we have a town green, some really nice quaint shops, um, a lot of great restaurants. Tucker's is one of my favorites. Uh, we have pharmacies, Dunkin' Donuts. Um, of course, we're in New England, so we have to have that. Um, and it's all within walking distance for sure. So, you know, I say we have the essentials um, and you can just take a nice little walk around campus as well um, and downtown uh, to New London. At Kobe Sawyer, we offer an experiential liberal arts education. So basically what that means is that if you're coming in um, with an intended major, um, you're not gonna solely just be studying um, that major. You're also gonna have to be taking an arts course, a humanities course, a science course, a math course. Every student has to take those um, to get your degree here at Kobe Sawyer. Um, it really opens up lots of options um, for, for exploration. Um, so something may spark your interest that you may have never even thought of before. Um, and you can pick up a minor um, or just take a few more courses within that discipline. All of our students are also required to do an internship. You have to be sophomore standing. And then when you um, are a senior, you do your capstone research project, um, which is a great opportunity to work one-on-one -on -one, um, with a faculty sponsor and really dive in deeper about one specific aspect of your discipline um, and then do the whole research process and present it. And then going off what Izzy and John both have just said, we are a small school, so your average class size is around 13. You're going to have to complete an internship. A few of our majors will have a clinical component and that will be considered your internship. Um, but you're really gonna get to know your professors really well and get all the resources you need to help um, succeed with your internship and everything. We really encourage our students to get outside the classroom. That's part of our experiential learning campus. We have a couple of different ways students can do that, whether it's participating in one of our 70 plus clubs and organizations, Wacky Bingo, we have guest speakers, concerts. There's a lot of different things that go on behind the scenes. We also have one of our famous traditions called Mountain Day, where one day in the fall, um, classes are canceled and everybody get, puts on their tie-dye t-shirts that they made. And we head over to Mount Kearsarge. We hike the mountain, um, take a massive picture at the top, sign the banner. And um, at the bottom, um, there's a massive picnic for the entire campus. It's a really great community builder um, and an awesome way for all of our students to get outside the classroom um, and experience the fall. Alrighty, so we are in um, the Gene Act Division uh, 3 NCAA Athletics. Um, so Greater Northeast Atlantic Conference is what we play in uh, for most of our sports. Uh, we have men's and women's sports, lots of different um, opportunities for sure. Uh, alpine skiing, equestrian, and rugby do play in kind of separate um, 
um, you know, conferences as well, um, but still underneath the NCAA. Um, we have a really great facility out back. Um, this is Kelsey Field out back. We have our turf field um, right behind um, that is our baseball field. Um, and then if, before the picture, we also have um, our soccer field, which is all grass as well. Um, we have Hogan Sports Center um, that houses, um, you know, our swim team, swim and diving team. Um, we have a pool in there. Um, we also have our varsity basketball gym and volleyball gym as well there. Um, and we have um, great facilities for um, uh, athletic training to get your yeah, ankles taped and stuff like that. Coaches' offices are up there in Hogan as well. And we also have a varsity weight gym. Um, which is a really great opportunity for our varsity athletics to have their own gym to go in there and do some strength training and whatnot. Um, so really great things overall with our athletics. Um, we're happy to, you know, continue to build our athletics as well. If you're interested at all, feel free to fill out the recruitment forms online on our athletics page for your respective sport. Um, and that way you can get in contact with your coaches um, early as well. So a little bit about how to apply to Kobe Sawyer. Um, we have two possible options for you. We have the Common app, and then we also have the Colby Sawyer app. Um, it doesn't matter to us which one you fill out. Um, there is no application fee for both of them, which is great. We do have some deadlines, though. We have early action, which is December 1st. Um, along with the early action deadline, there's an attached scholarship. Um, so students applying for this upcoming year um, are awarded a an additional $6,000 each year. Um, so it's a great opportunity just to get your applications done and out of the way and get some extra money. And then we also have our nursing priority deadline, which is December 1st. So this year, due to COVID-19, we are not requiring um, test scores. So the only thing for nurses that are due on that day is your application piece and then an additional nursing essay, which you will find in your application. And then, so Izzy was saying our early action reward. So this, um, if you apply by December 1st, you will get $6,000 every single year. And then we also have merit-based scholarships. So based on your GPA, when you apply, they will range anywhere from $15,000 to $28,000 award, um, which is renewable all four years um, if you keep a 2.0 GPA. And then we also, um, financial aid, FAFSA um, opens October 1st. If you have any questions with financial aid or need any assistance with that, please feel free to contact our financial aid office and they'll be able to walk you through um, any problems that you might have. This is just a list of some of the ways that you can visit campus. Um, this week we started tours back up. So um, we are um, available for visitors within the New England area. So if you are in New England, you can come and visit campus, just register on our website. We also have um, Meet Your Admissions Counselor through a virtual conversation. You can register for that on our web website as well. Um, and we have our self-guided tour available um, on the website right under our visit page. Um, so like I said, registration for all events is located on our website at colby-sawyer.edu. Alrighty, everyone. Thank you so much. Um, if there's any questions, feel free to reach out to us. Um, again, we had our emails listed before, um, so feel free to reach out to us with any questions. We wish you the best of luck with your application process um, and your best of luck with your, um, your semester, your senior year as well. Um, hope you have a good one and hope to see you on campus soon. Bye.